I'm gonna be honest, I don't know how I'm gonna start this video, but it is what it is. I already just turned on the camera, but it's been a while. <laughs> it's been a hectic while. I know every time I come back, I always say like things are different, things have changed, but as you can see, things have changed. Things have really changed drastically. We went from um, zero to a thousand really quick, but we're back, thankfully. Um, I know there's this little glare. I can't do anything about it, so bear with me. I'll try to get it to work the best I can. But, I don't know. I don't know, again, how I was supposed to start this video. It's supposed to be a little bit of a comeback. I think I uploaded the last video was a stream video. I really didn't explain it well. I was on my way to work right before I filmed that. But, um, I don't know. How you been? <laughs> what have you been up to? If there's anybody watching this. The other video got... What, seven views? It's better than nothing, better than zero. It's better than the fucking hole. But, I don't know. Things have changed. Everything's on a steady decline, but it's steady. It could be worse. It could have been going down, just falling down hell. Um, anything on my mind? Just been working. Just been. I don't know if there's anyone really else out there watching this video that just feels like everyone's moving like doing things not even moving like moving out of the house everyone's just moving doing things doing things here or there partying here and you're just working you're just doing the same thing waking up doing the same thing just graduated co uh, not college high school that it was supposed to be special it was alright it can't be ungrateful it was alright really, really really cool time to be honest but um I don't know, I just feel like I've been doing the same now. I don't know if I'm going to go to college, looking into the Air Force. Or hopefully this works out, who knows. I just got a message from somebody. Who knows. Let me talk about this person. I've been talking to a girl. I don't know if it'll work out. Hopefully. She's a really pretty girl. She makes me feel special. Huh, what do you know about that? But, um, I don't know. It just feels like we're both slowly losing. Feelings, I guess, we both went from texting each other, not even lagging on each other for like a minute, just immediate sex, and now we're both lagging on each other for like seven minutes straight. Sucks, sucks. But it is what it is, you work over it. Sometimes I feel like she's the one, sometimes I feel like I should bash my head into the skull, into the, into the skull, I should bash my head into the wall. But again, we work around it. We're here for something, I guess. Who knows? We're here for something. A lot of my friends like me. I think they do. Hopefully they're my friends. A lot of people like me more than I expected. Put myself out there more. Even though it's just my workplace. I didn't think I would get along with everybody as much. Even though today, technically, August 8th, I am a year. Been there working for a year. So... I think it's kind of reasonable I get along with everybody pretty easy, but there's people, but they're all young, um, that I have to teach, or just, I get on break, and they're on break, and I talk to them, they're like, oh, like you have great people skills, like, but really though, are you just being nice, or what, what, what's the deal? I'm sorry if the camera's moving a lot like that, I bought this wiggly desk I built, so, yeah, I built it, so, it's not a good start, but, I don't know. A lot of things on my mind, just token, <laughs> work, and um, I don't know, college just seems pretty profound. Everybody's going to college, everyone's kind of forcing me to college. And it's a good thing if everyone's doing that, I guess, right? Or am I just being a sheep falling in the herd? I don't know. It is what it is. There's really no, nothing else to fight it. Even though if I do go a different direction at the end of the day, everyone, it sounds cheesy, but it is technically true. It's like everyone's gonna die. No one's really gonna remember you. Their past kids, they're not gonna remember you. So it's like, even if you do get out of this, what's it called, circle or um, what are like, what do people call it now? What this, what's it called, the simulation and all that. Versus working a nine to five, dying like that, growing just until we're old. Um, even if you do get out of this, um, what's it called society. Oh, does it really matter? 
does it really matter? It's like no one really cares. There was that one guy, leopard guy, that went out. I can cool remembers about him now. I don't know. I'm just kind of high, kind of just oh, just thinking shit. I guess. Just went to Y, came back, got this nice bracelet slender tattoo by a really cool artist. Really cool artist. He was really cool. We stayed there into his place for like three hours because it was five of us. We all took it together. It was all the same thing, blah, blah, blah. It's just a turtle. Nothing special. But, um, why do you look like that? Oh, it's just, I should probably just hold it like this. I don't know. I do want to get more of a better setup, you could say. An actual camera, actual head, like not headphones, actual mic. But for it, this does it. Like, to be honest, it really just does it. Um, yeah, there's really just not a lot to talk about. It's not even that a lot to talk about. It's just a lot of things going on. Um, I wish there was. Everyone's doing things. I'm trying to do things. You can see me here. I'm trying to do things, but you think you know what the thing is? I just I I try, I try to rush. I try to put a little bit of effort and expect a lot. I need to work on that. But um, again, just I'm trying. I'm trying. Try to get along. Just shit's shit's difficult. This whole this whole living, but <laughs> we'll get through it. We'll get through it. Your turn to talk. <laughs> nah. Um, oh no. This, again, like this was supposed to make my comeback, but I didn't know how to start it. And neither did I want to plan something to make, have it not feel like genuine. So I was just like, just pop the camera, do it. But we've seen that every time I just do, like, turn on the camera like that, it kind of works out. I don't know if this video has been a disaster or not, but for right now it's going well. Um, I recently just moved out that old place, got into a little bit better one. I just miss my dog. She used to be in my room and all that with me. Not anymore. She's outside. She actually has a little bit of a house. I know she misses me. She's always scrunching up against the windows and all that. Mm -hmm. Windows, not windows. The walls are very thin. So if you hear me talking a certain way, I'm just not having to have the other people around me listen to me. Um, it feels comfortable. I haven't. I don't have internet yet, but um, everything it feels comfortable right now. Everything's cool. Everything's chilling. Um, another message from that person. Damn, like, I'm not gonna lie, my mom, my mind keeps trying to go back to him. Um, it just sucks, Loki. Like, you put so much effort into something, and you try your best, and now you just feel like, damn, I can feel it go away. I can, f even though it's like, I don't know, I'm a very realistic person, I try to think, it just kind of feels like we're both don't know how to let go. We both like the attention that we both gave gave each other. Well, I didn't. Um, I liked her a lot. I like her a lot. A lot. It's like a, a phone line. The way I, I like her, I don't want to say love yet. A little too soon. But if all the like, like all the affection I have for her was like form into one like physical thing, it would probably be the size of a dinosaur. Pretty big dinosaur. But, um, it is what it is. Things just happen. You gotta learn how to get over it. I think it will help you. You'll look back at it and be grateful it happened. That's the way I like to think about things. I don't know if it helps me. It could be linked to some trauma or something, but it's helping me. It's helping me. Um, working out helps me a lot, too. Getting stoned helps me a lot, too. Anxiety's just a bitch. That's all. That's really all. Everything is crazy. All the homies and we're all working. Like it feels where the excuse used to be now before like the whole work and just graduation thing it used to be like, Oh, my parents are letting me I'm grounded. I got caught doing this so I can't go out or this or that. But now it's just bro, I can't. I work today. I work today. Too tired today. Today's my only day off. I gotta do this, I gotta do that. I gotta go to the dealership, I gotta go to the what's I gotta do the DMV, I gotta pay this. It's like damn. It's like damn bro the hell happened to us? We just went from like having a sesh behind <laughs> behind the school every morning before and leaving early and like going to get breakfast burritos and now we're just like none of us can really hang now. Well, you can see it in our faces like I know my homies like work, work's getting to us and it sucks. Lukey sucks. I've talked to him a lot I'm like let's work together we can get something off the road even though it doesn't matter 
or it doesn't really, um, yeah, it doesn't really matter if we get out of this. It's like, it's better than doing this. At least we'll be able to rest for a little bit, but, I don't know. Um, I read a thing that was, like, comfort's, like, a really addictive, or it's, like, the most addicting thing ever, or, like, the most dangerous addiction, because supposedly, like, a man will give away all ambition just for, like, regular sex, good TV, and, like, just food, and just a bed to sleep. And if you think about it, it's like, damn, so he choose, like, all I want, so he's just good food, just regular sex, and just my bed, cheap entertainment. And it's like, damn, low-key, it is true. But it's like, you kind of ask yourself, you're like, how did I get to this point then? How did I get to this point where I'm thinking about comfort like this? So it's kind of mind-boggling, but it is what it is. Just got to work on yourself, see what how the things really are, not be blind about it, and just actually work towards it. I like a lot of my friends through text. I really try not to. It's like, if it's not even that I don't see it. It's like I hear my phone ring and I tell myself, I'm going to check it right now. I just never check it. I never do. So <laughs> it just sucks because they all feel a certain way. And I think that's what happened to that girl. I would always lie on her backs and I would always be so pissed at myself. And now that I probably should have gotten ready for this video. I, my hair's not even ready. Look at this tie-dye shirt. It's like, what am I doing? Look at the background. Look at the background's all right. But, um. Uh, yeah, I should have gotten ready, but I didn't. I just want kind of more. I was like, let me just record and get it through. And it's heading towards the 12 minute mark pretty quick, to be honest. I looked at one minute, it was like six. And now it's already at, it was at nine, now it's already at almost 10. No, it's almost at 12. I'm really high. I'm really high. But, um, I don't know. Thank you for listening for <laughs> to today's episode, I guess. Or whatever it is. I don't know if it's a podcast, a show, or it's just like. An internet diary type thing. I don't know. I guess it's just talking to this guy. I guess this was part two. And I really hope you're having a good ass day. Just remember, keep to yourself. Be kind. Honestly, it's like, when you feel good when someone's kind to you, it's like, everyone feels like that. Even though they're dickheads, everyone feels like that. Everyone likes when people are kind to them. So it's just like, be kind. Be on ice. Come on, man. Don't be a dickhead. Things come around. And don't like on your girls. Don't like on your hoes. Even though this girl for me is not a hoe. Don't like on your hoes, man. You got this. And if you're a girl, don't play with guys. It sucks. And same thing for guys. Guys, don't play with girls. It sucks. It sucks. I'm pretty sure they feel the same. But let me wrap up this video. I really hope you are having a good ass day. And thank you for liking this video. Not, not for liking this video. For watching this video. And yeah, just hope you can drop a like after that mistake. But yeah. Um, let's see when the next video comes out. And yeah. Peace out.